November 8, 1969, Sister Kathy Chesnick is reported missing from her home in the Carriage House Apartments after a trip to the Edmonton Village Shopping Center. January 3rd, 1970, her body is found in a Lansdowne dump. Baltimore County says it's actively investigating her murder, and detectives are looking for three other similar unsolved murders for possible connections. 20-year-old Joyce Malecki disappeared not long after Sister Kathy, November 11th, 1969 from the Herondale Mall. She was found dead two days later at a shooting range area at Fort Meade. Anne Arundel County police are again actively looking into the death of Pamela Lynn Conyers, one of the oldest open cold case murder investigations in the county. 16-year-old Conyers went to a bonfire pep rally at Glen Burnie High School on October 16, 1970. Later, she drove the family car to the Herondale Mall in Glen Burnie. When she didn't come back from the store, her parents reported her missing. Her body was found October 20th in a wooded area along what is now Route 100 near the Waterford Road Route 648 overpass. Anne Arundel County Police say they examined the Joyce Malecki case in 2001 and found no connection to the Conyers case. There is also the case of 16-year-old Grace Elizabeth Gay Montagna, extensively covered in the news. She was last seen at Franklin High School after meeting a stranger at a Reisterstown shopping center and found dead on September 29, 1971, in Westport, in an area used for dumping behind the Mount Auburn Cemetery off of Annapolis Road. The Baltimore Police Department is investigating her case. In the last 20 years, Anne Arundel County Police say they have submitted evidence to forensic laboratories to apply modern techniques to identify possible suspects. All evidence that is suitable has been entered into state and national databases. Now, police agencies are coming, uh, comparing notes, and they say that no piece of information is too small. The FBI issued a statement saying, FBI Baltimore continues to pursue any and all investigative leads in the Joyce Malecki murder investigation. The Netflix documentary, The Keepers, is rightfully bringing attention to the senseless and unsolved murders of Sister Kathy Chesnick and Joyce Malecki. As in all cold case homicides, it is never too late to contact law enforcement authorities if you know anything about the crime. Lisa Robinson, WBAL-TV 11 News.